CNN teve acesso à região da Rússia, que foi alvo da ofensiva ucraniana. O repórter Nick Peyton Walsh visitou uma cidade ocupada pelas forças ucranianas e destacou a intensidade em que a guerra se encontra. All around us, the signs of the intense fight that's been raging inside here. It's very surreal to be inside Russia again with Ukrainian forces leading the way. Well, not even the statue of Lenin is unscathed here. This Ukrainian assault, so persistent, and Russia, despite its sense of history, its sort of past as being so impregnable, completely unable to push the Ukrainians out here. The sound of small arms fire we can still hear, so clearly there is a bid for the Russians to push back, but it simply isn't working, and the humiliation for Putin endures. You can see the damage that's been done to this street here from the intense fight that raged and still clearly active fighting happening here. And there's still the question is, where are the drones? Where are the Russian drones that have made Ukraine's life hell on the front lines for months? Simply nowhere to be seen. Although there's constant artillery as well, clearly a fight still underway for this, which has become deeply symbolic for Ukraine's totally surprise assault into Russia.